was when I woke up, you know what I mean? And it was just based on that. So, you know, I don't, like, that's that's not me. So it didn't rub me the wrong way. That ain't who I am. You feel what I'm saying? And, and every real motherfucker in the streets will tell you that too, man, you know? But um, his popularity has seemed to overpass a lot of the code. You feel what I'm saying? It could just, that's just based on how the game going now, man, and how misdirected these kids is, man. You feel me? They see the fame, and they start to listen, and that's what they go by, man. But you know what, man? I'm right here, man, to set it straight, set the record straight, man, and I'm pulling up. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and I'm pulling up big, man. You know what I mean? Stretched, hurting big, like, you feel me? And, and, and it feel good, man, to whip back up and, and let the people know, you know, this is what's right, man. You feel me? At the end of the day, I don't condone no snitching. But at the same time, if you don't stand up for yourself in situations like this, then they'll fuck over every human being they can. You understand what I'm saying? So you have to, you have to, at some point in your life, you have to take a stand for yourself so other people can take a stand for you. Because if you don't, then them motherfuckers will just continue to fuck everybody over. You know what I'm saying? So that shit didn't rub me the wrong way, man. I listened to that shit, man, and laughed at that shit. You feel me? With my, I couldn't really laugh. It hurted to laugh. You feel me? That's how fucked up I was, man. They put some good work on me. You feel what I'm saying? Um, and like I said, I still get the nausea. You feel me? Um, and all that, man. You feel what I'm saying? And, and y'all seen it, man. It's on everything. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and it's just unfortunate that it happened the way it happened. This ain't never happened to me before in my life. Man, I can probably walk anywhere in the United States of America, in any ghetto, in any hood, and hold my head up high, man. I've done it for the past 20 years, man, in, in my profession alone, you know, with, with, with the things that I do, you know, my other gig. You feel what I'm saying? So. It's like, I don't have a, I don't, I don't, you know what I'm saying, I ain't never had no problem with getting out here dealing with the people. And, and sometimes that's, that makes the people, uh, that that makes the, the, the people frustrated because nowadays they can't come look me in my face and I'm not the, as approachable as I was because I'm trying to keep it. Uh, be more professional with my profession. You feel what I'm saying? So when you used to just talking to somebody and being able to walk up to them and, 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 and kick it and laugh and, and look them in the face and all that, you know, that's one thing, man. And, and, and when you when you can't, you know, you, you get you get just that, man. Oh, we can't, and we can't, and now it's, you know what I'm saying? So, so one thing I've learned about the media, the media is not opinionated, but people are. You know, so that means people are human beings. They're always going to have an opinion. But they in the nosebleed seats doing the yelling and shit while I'm on the court. So that means I really can't hear none of that shit. You feel what I'm saying? And best believe next game, the motherfuckers going to be up there yelling and shit till I score. When I score again, they're going to be right back on my dick screaming. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know, remember that, man. Nail the world there, man. Be, you know, be, just come to some type of... um grips, you know, with reality, man, people are going to be opinionated, because we're humans, man, but the media don't, so once they get a hold of something and turn it and twist it the way that they want to, you know, if you don't go head up with them, you know what I'm saying, that's exactly what it's going to be, you know what I'm saying, so a lot of that shit, it don't bother me, you feel what I'm saying, because them niggas in the nosebleed seats, man, every game, until I score, you feel me, as soon as the niggas score, man, you know, they'll be right back screaming and yelling for me. You feel what I'm saying? And that's cool, because that's people. You feel me? What's up, though? So, I mean, you got this whole mixtape catered to Filthy. I mean, is it really going to is it really gonna happen? Definitely. Definitely. Um, The streets already know, you feel me, what type of a, a man he is. You know, anyway, man. Brother's a bitch. You feel me? Brian never did nothing. What he did was he used the lifestyle... And, and gangland, when they came, looks like they come to everybody else's, you know, part of the section, you know, to do their filming for the intel, you know, as well as the, the informational, you know, things that come up out of our lifestyle, you know what I'm saying? So when they show up, he do all the talking and not, you know, uh, he don't realize because he's so arrogant and so fucking stupid. He don't realize, man, the shit that the that foundation that these others been laid down, man, you know, that ain't the code anyway. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know, um, if you want to talk about snitching, that's a whole lot of dry snitching right there. You feel what I'm saying? And I ain't got nothing against uh, 
CNN or ABC or NBC or none of that shit, CBC, whatever. But 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 at the end of the day, you know, um, you you glorifying, you 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 letting the camera in to exploit. You feel me? And when you exploit, you doing just that. So the shit that he did, that's how he, he made his career. You know, and, and that shit is very popular. But you ain't did nothing for that foundation out there, man. You know what I'm saying? And there's some OGs that then came home. You feel me? And they saying the same thing. Who is this nigga? You feel me? That money and shit. Nobody. I, I fear nobody. Anybody in the world to tell you that, man? I done been in the most notorious places in the fucking world, homeboy. I don't fear. You know why? I don't, and I don't lie. Cause when you lie, that means you're scared and you fear. You feel what I'm saying, bro? I've been solid all my life, bro. I ain't never been through none of this shit. But there, there it is again, that word opportunity. When it presents itself and you ain't ready, then, you know, shit like this happen. But, bro, bro, bro's a bitch, bro. You feel what I'm saying? He ain't never did nothing but exploit sin. You feel me? And use that shit for promotion to fuel that garbage-ass shit that he been putting out. Let me tell you something, bro, about this Bay Area, bro, about the Bay Area, bro. I sell so many records in that market. You understand? That's the hardest market to break in the fucking uh, the industry, bro. You feel me? I think the second largest market. You understand what I'm saying? That dude has sold 60,000 records. His whole entire catalog, cool, my nigga, he ain't, he's lying, bro. You feel me, bro? A, a, a bitch. My nigga, that's what bitches do. They lie, they get dressed, then they lie, you feel me, on Friday to come up on that nigga, you feel me, and, and, and think they hit the lotto. That's what bitches do. He's a bitch. He's a liar, bruh. You feel what I'm saying? And he used the, the, the what he did uh, on, on, on the gang land for promotion and then turned around and making this shit look bigger than what it is. That nigga put out 25 albums and sold a 60-piece wing stop all dry. Lemon, no pepper. That nigga's a lemon, my nigga. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know, you can't compare that dude to me, man. I'm damn near a ghetto million, bruh. Soul, bruh. No major record deal, bruh. I've been doing this shit, man. This this, this my pastime right here, bruh. I'm on other things. You feel me? And I'm doing other things. But this right here, you can't tell me nothing about. And then all those features he got, Jim Jones and Waka Flocka and 2 Chainz, all that shit digitally online ain't sold over 10,000 fucking downloads all together. You feel what I'm saying? So let's just put the 70 on your whole career, bruh. You garbage as fuck. You know what I'm saying? And you running around here making the shit look good and hyping the shit up. Yeah, what's happening? It's the kid, man. Little papered up mess. The boy, boy. Man, you locked into the sickness.net. You already know. We finna get it. day one. And these principles are not to destroy a man, but to create one, blood. Seven, did I be what Filthy Rich just posted on IG? The jury's still up there.